Have you ever sat at an easel canvas, scrapbook, craft room, and been thoroughly stuck? I have I learned in the last few years that um, uh, emotional, personal trauma can shut down our creativity and it's called creativity fatigue, creative fatigue, or creative block. The thing. And so it's when your creative well kind of dries up and you go from being able to create, enjoy, express yourself to not even being able to doodle. And that is why I'm here. So I come alongside creatives and help them refine that spark, burst that into that bonfire that it used to be in spite of past experiences. So one of the ways that I have done that is through this program called Ruby and it's AI. I don't, don't let that scare you because it's easy. It's easy AI. And I'm going to be sharing on this platform about how to use it and how it sparked my creativity. Sometimes you're just stuck. So if you want to create, maybe you want to, maybe you just want a, a prompt. Like I need a writing prompt today. So what you do is you click on this chat and you click right here and it says start typing. So give me a writing prompt. Whoops. It doesn't care about typos. Prompt around gardening. And boom. So it's imagine a world where plants have the ability to communicate with humans. So that's 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 a story writing prompt. So give me a journaling prompt for today. Reflect on a recent challenge you faced and how you overcame it. What did you learn about yourself in the process? Write about the growth and strength you discovered within yourself during this experience. So there is your writing prompt for today. Reflect on a recent challenge you faced and how you overcame it. Focus on the overcoming it part. You're a rock star. You're amazing. You're strong, powerful, intelligent. You've got this and I'm here for you. Let me know what you thought of this. It was really fun to share and I'm more than glad to show you any of this or share components of it. There's a lot more I have coming for you. Have a great day.